so in this video let us complete the show employee details method okay the complete I uh, will consume the get method and also display the employee details in the material uh, no, design table so let's quickly do that now that we have uh, done all these things for department it should be fairly easy to replicate the same thing for department as well I mean the employee as well so let's start with the department service right so employee service also has the same should also have the same content except the fact that we are now calling the employee APIs instead of the department APIs right so let's copy the same thing from the department service and paste in the employee service so let's uh, in detail check what are the changes that we have to make is that instead of department it should be employee model let's copy that we may need it so this should be employee model and then this is supposed to be employee service and uh, form data will be of the type employee and uh, observable get so this will be also employee employee here also employee just paste employee wherever we find department okay and then finally this thing so instead of update DEP it should be employee right so let's copy this and replace wherever is needed employee get employee list okay now let's close everything and open up the show department component as well as show employee component dot HTML so here also almost everything remains the same but except the fact that we are now trying to display the employee details instead of the department details so we may have additional um, additional fields right so let's see what are the changes that we are gonna have to make here so these things will remain the same so here instead of sending the department ID we are now sending employee ID okay and the same thing goes here instead of department ID it is employee ID and instead of department name it is employee name let's copy and paste it here as well so this thing is done now apart from these two fields employee <coughs> details also has additional fields such as department right so let's copy department and paste here okay <clears throat> and as well as after department they have let me see they have mail ID and date of joining mail ID and date of joining so let's have the mail ID first mail ID let's copy and paste here here and finally date of joining date of joining is copy paste here and here so I think that should be fine so instead of the button name as add department it should now be add employee right okay now let's close this and now let's concentrate on the file which is edit department component dot ts and sorry add no 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 not this show department component dot ts and show employee component dot ts okay now let's see what are the things that we have to copy from these uh, show department so let's copy the entire thing all the imports and try to change okay so let's copy and paste 
so first line is fine second line third line it should be employee instead of employee instead of department so this should be employee service instead of department service fine so this should be add employee component instead of add department component fine and finally this should be edit <coughs> employee component instead of edit department component okay now let's see what are the things that we need so the constructor will remain the same let's copy the same thing as that in the constructor and instead of uh, service as department service we have employee service okay then let's also call this copy this event listener okay and we have have to write refresh employee list method which we're going to do now in some time so let's copy the columns that are supposed to be displayed so it is employee id okay and then employee name department mail id and finally date of joining and then let's implement the refresh list method so let's copy this and paste here so instead of refresh department list it should be refresh employee list let's remove the unwanted things so it should be get employee list and then i think we have missed out the sort so where do we define the sort thing so it's here let's copy this one as well and uh, paste it here so I think that now it should be fine we should be able to see the employee details let's see if that thing works so employee show employee there's some issue we'll see what that is show employee component 47 okay 47 so we have to have closing braces so let's click on employees and uh, one more thing that we are missing is we have to have this selector in the parent employee component HTML so let's have that let's have the selector now let's see if that thing works click on employee and I guess the uh, service okay let me get back to the service and see if everything is fine so we have API slash employee okay and uh, show employee.html dot ts we have to call the refresh employee list method which we are not calling refresh employee list so let's see if that thing works now let's click on employees and now we are able to see the employee details 
ओके फाइन सो द नेक्स्ट वीडियो मे बी विल इंप्लीमेंट द पुट एंड देन मे बी द डिलीट मेथड ओके